Yo, what's good, y'all? It's me, Big D. You feel me? Dizzy Day Namar. I'm back. I haven't talked to y'all in a minute, and that's my bad. I'm sorry. Just life been getting ahead of me. You feel me? I've been trying to just work on me and make sure that I'm good, but you know, I know y'all don't really care about that. Look, right now, I'm about to head over to Best Buy to get a new lens for my camera. Right now, y'all seeing the Sigma 16 millimeter 1.4. Super nice, you see the bokeh in the back is doing his thing. I'm using the Sony FX30 right now and I just needed something a little wider because I wanted to, to vlog a little more, right? I wanted to take y'all around and just show y'all a different side of me, you feel me? I feel like this is a good vlogging lens but sometimes it's just a little too tight for me. But you know, let's see what this new lens could really offer. I'm getting the Sony 11 millimeter E lens for APS-C camera because I do have the FX30. But I'll be back with the new lens and we'll replace it on camera so you guys can see the difference between the 16 millimeter and the 11 millimeter and just like what it could do. I'm definitely keeping both lenses, so either way I'm gonna have both because it's nice to have both focal lengths, but you know, something different for the channel. What's popping, y'all? I'm back here on the vlog and this is the lens right here, the Sony E-mount 11 millimeter f1.8 lens. Um, you know, if you if you guys care about tech and everything, you guys might like it, but if you don't, it's cool, you feel me? I'm just here to show y'all exactly what kind of things I'm using to film my content because I get asked that a lot. So I just opened it right now. You can see it's just a bubble wrap and some instruction manuals. Definitely not gonna read the instruction manuals, just to be real with y'all, it's just, I don't really care. So let's go ahead and look at this lens real quick, man. Unwrap it out of the plastic. So the lens also comes with this, uh, this thing right here to block out sunlight. I forgot what they're called. Just this thing, you throw it on here, but then I'm not sure what it's called, I forgot. But yeah, this is the lens right here. It's pretty, you know, small, average. It'll work though, you feel me? It'll work for what I need it to work for, you feel me? So let's throw this on while I give y'all a quick little update, at least about what my life has been. And you guys can see the difference between this lens right here, which is a 16 millimeter Sigma lens, and this Sony 11 millimeter. Can y'all tell, look at all this space I got right here. You feel me? I look small. You feel me? I'm not that small. I, I, you feel me? I could, I could for sure throw hands if they need me to throw hands. I'm not that small. But this is crazy. I love how wide it is. You feel me? This is definitely going to help with my content with YouTube, Instagram, TikTok. You feel me? Just so I can get more out of the image and just really bring everything in. But wow, look at this. Look at this. Look at my apartment. This is definitely more of the vlogging setup that I was going for. A little dark right there. But how y'all how y'all like it, man? How y'all feeling about this? Y'all like this? I feel like I can get more personal with y'all and actually talk with y'all on this. But you know, while we're doing this, let me give y'all a quick little life update too. So as y'all can tell, I'm not in the living room anymore. I am not living with the homie Chow May no more. I actually got an apartment with my girl, which is crazy, you feel me? I've never lived with a significant other, but I think it's going well so far and you know, like, we're doing well, so that's that's nice. You feel me? That's good. So this is my recording setup right here. I have it out in the living room. I actually upgraded that too, so I can show y'all right here. Sony C100 microphone. This is a. Uh, it's clean, man. It's clean. It's not no C800G, but it works. You feel me? My desk is messy right now, but I'm still gonna show y'all. Cause yeah, uh, let me just make sure I close my laptop because I got some confidential stuff I don't want to show y'all yet. But I recently got this for my birthday. I got the WA73 EQ and the warm audio limiting compressor, the WA76. And uh, it makes my vocals sound super crisp and clear. I have just been working as much as I can, man, on music, just in life, trying to grow as a person. There's a lot going on, but honestly, the reason I got this lens is because I'm going to be doing a lot more shows. I'm actually doing a little bit of the Sabaidi Fest tour. Uh, when they hit Berkeley, I'm gonna be there. When they hit uh, Pachanga, which is in Temecula, California, I'm gonna be there. And I also am opening for Marky Basie on 420. <laughs> 420. But you feel me? That's just where I'm trying to go with it. I wanna take y'all along on this journey with me, and I wanted to you know, like get a more different kind of view from it. And I, I like this angle, this view, how y'all liking it? You feel me? If I go a little closer, you feel me? My, my face kind of gets a little wider, but it's good. It looks good, you feel me? I could chill with y'all, I could talk with y'all a little more. I'm excited about this, man. And I know I say it all the time, my uploads have been really inconsistent, but I'm trying to get better at this. So as I go on and continue to do life, I'm going to try to do at least one video a week. I'll try my best. Don't hold me to it. But you feel me? I really do hope you guys like the content that I do put out. But yeah, man, new lens, new field of view, new perspective on life for me too. Especially moving out of staying in the living room for a little bit. You feel me? But we here now. And uh, 
I love y'all, man. I'll talk to y'all soon. Peace.